Hi, this is Marlon Balbastro from WB Edits, and today I'm going to show you how to edit the ginger beer filter in Lightroom mobile app. Here are some photo examples of before and after using this filter. You can download this preset for free via the link in the description, but before that, the file is protected by the password. The password will appear in the upper right corner. The password will appear at any time. Make sure you pay close attention. The password consists of four digit numbers and will appear separately like this. All right, so let's get started. First open the light panel. Decrease image contrast to minus 2. Decrease highlights to minus 40. Brighten the shadows to 100. Set the whites to minus 6. And set the blacks to 50. Next go to curve. Just follow these steps. and then tap done. Open the color panel. Increase the temperature to 20. Increase image tint to 14. And decrease the saturation to minus 26. Next go to color grading. Select shadows. Set the hue to 50. Increase the saturation to 25. Set the blending to 100. And set the balance to 36. Then hit done. Go to color mix. Select the red color. Increase the hue to 6. Decrease the saturation to minus 50. And increase the luminance to 40. Select the orange color. Increase the hue to 40. Decrease the saturation to minus 12. And decrease the luminance to minus 12. Select the yellow color. Decrease the hue to minus 50. Decrease the saturation to minus 30. And increase the luminance to 50. Select the green color. Increase the hue to 46. Decrease the saturation to minus 50. And decrease the luminance to minus 34. Select the cyan color. Increase the hue to 30. Decrease the saturation to minus 32. And increase the luminance to 36. Select the blue color. Increase the hue to 24. And decrease the saturation to minus 52. Select the purple color. 
decrease the saturation to minus 50 and increase the luminance to 30 and last select the magenta increase the luminance to 30 then hit done open the effects panel increase the clarity to 34 open the detail panel and set the noise reduction to 26 now let's try this settings to another photo tap the ellipses button or three dots in the upper right corner copy settings tap on the check mark paste the settings now let's look at the before and after if you don't get the right tone for your photo you can join my youtube channel to get 10 presets that you can choose from to match your photo the looks great try this on your own photos thanks for watching